Danny, a tough match against Northampton tomorrow. What, what do you expect for that test? Yeah, obviously we expect them to be to be very decent. Um, they're up the the top end of the table, um, and I think the Gaffers have been telling us they're unbeaten in, in seven or eight games. So we expect a tough game. Um, we've obviously watched them, analysed them, but hopefully if we implement our, our game plan, we can we can pick up some points. Obviously we're in good form at home, and yeah, hopefully we can we can get some points. How has training been this week on the back of what was a good victory away from home? Yeah, good mood in the camp is obviously good. Um, we had a bit of a blip last week, bad performance and, and obviously knocked out of the FA Cup. So I think we bounced back well. Um, I think we dominated most of the game against Rochdale and yeah, we we done really well. So training has been, it's been decent and everyone in, in good spirits. Um, so hopefully we can take that into, into the game tomorrow. A big part of that was coming from behind in the game. We had a couple of chances early on, but we conceded the goal. We sort of regrouped ourselves and dominate a game away from home and came out with some good goals and a good result. Yeah, it's obviously obviously a good thing to be able to go 1-0 down, even 2-0 down and, and not lose hope. Um, it's obviously a good group of lads here, so good mix of youth and experience and the experienced ones kind of help settle us down if we do go a goal down and, and I thought we bounced back really well. We started the game well against Rochdale, obviously they, they got the goal and then um, yeah, we bounced back really well and, and it was a dominant performance, dominant win, um, four goals. So. Yeah, showed good character. It was a bit of a different role for you in that game, playing in more central position in the middle of the park alongside Tom and Folks. How was that for your experience? Yeah, it was different, obviously. Um, coming up in Ireland and, and at Huddersfield, obviously I'm kind of an out-and-out -out winger. Um, but obviously we've had we've had some injuries, suspensions, um, and we had to change the formation. So, so the gaffer asked me to kind of play a more narrow role. Um, obviously I had two experienced boys in beside me in, in Folks and, and Tomo, but yeah, I enjoyed it. Obviously, it's it's a bit different. Maybe less one v ones and things like that, and, and more more so winning seconds, trying to get on the ball, trying to get us going forward a little bit more. But yeah, I enjoyed it. It's a bit more of an added responsibility the manager put on you. Is that a positive sign for you to see the the sort of trust he has in you to give you that role? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I think obviously you, you probably wouldn't put a player in the middle of the park if if you didn't trust them to kind of get on the ball, get about, and make sure that that, that you keep the ball. You're you're tidy on it. So I think you know the gaffers maybe built up that trust now. I've been here for, for a couple of months now and it's obviously a good sign. And you had a couple of chances as well, you still got that instinct to a, a player that likes to play in the front foot? Yeah, obviously it was, I think it was the first minute of the game, the ball, I, I kind of broke forward and the ball fell to me. Um, probably took a little bit too long and, and the, the Rochdale defender got across and made a block but hopefully there's a goal coming this weekend. And looking to Northampton, they're a team in good form <coughs> but sure we in probably a good test given the fact the position they hold in the league. Yeah, as I said, obviously I, I think we're in good form. We had a bit of a blip last week, but in terms of our performances, especially at home, um, we've been a really good team. And on the ball, I think we've dominated most games at home. Um, but as as you said, Northampton are a really good team up up the top end of the table, so we expect a, a really tough game. But hopefully, we can we can implement ourselves on them and, and hopefully get a few goals, win the game. Our last match before Christmas as well. A lot of supporters will be turning out for that one. What's your message to them ahead of the game? Yeah, no, we appreciate obviously the support at home has, has been really good the last few weeks, which obviously comes with the performances. Hopefully we've we've kind of given the fans um, a bit of pride when they've come and watched us, you know. I think as a team we've we've given our all, we've got the ball down, we've tried to play and, and we've scored goals at home to be fair. So um the message to them was just keep coming. Um, we're really enjoying it and obviously as you can see in the results and the performances it's it's pushing us on. So